Bismillah, alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala rasulillah wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in nama ba'd. There's uh, something that needs to be addressed. This is with regards to studying with a qualified Sunni teacher. And uh, many times uh, we hear and we see that the students are in a rush to finish. And this is not correct. This is not the uh, traditional way of studying. Just to add to your, you know, your so-called resume that you took a book apparently um, with so-and-so uh, teacher. And many people they collect these uh, uh, these things, like they collect books and they collect these types of things uh, to possibly push themselves uh, forward. Uh, but you find that, that there's no barakah in the knowledge assuming that you gained any type of knowledge. Um, uh, and, and you see that some have this long resume, but they don't have much knowledge. And they've been here, they've been there, and they studied with uh, this uh, sheikh and this, uh, this, this teacher, finished this book and that book. But you find that there are holes in their knowledge. So you attended... But what did you gain? Right? And, and some are probably even rushing the teacher. Uh, some are not looking to interact with the teacher. You know, no questions. Not interacting in class. Yeah, they're just in the background. So, uh, you know, hours and hours of the, uh, these types of experiences... And at the end, you say, I took this book with this teacher. And it looks good, mashallah. You know, someone uh, looking at that is going to say, oh, mashallah, so-and-so, he took this book with, the, with this teacher? Mashallah. You know, they, they must be, you know, um, at, at a decent level uh, in knowledge. But uh, this goes back to intention. It goes back, you know, to, to barakah, to the blessings in, in your knowledge, in your pursuit of knowledge. Um, so this is a reminder that you know, we, we need to focus on the knowledge itself. Right? If that book, I mean, and there are extremes. Obviously, some of the primer books, I mean, it shouldn't take years to study a primer, for example. Uh, but, you know, one uh, should take their time because you want to have, you know, that proficiency in that book to eventually teach it. So take your time. Trust the teacher. If you don't trust the teacher, I don't know why you're studying with that teacher anyway. Trust the process, the, the classical, traditional way of study. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, inshallah, will facilitate uh, your affairs with regards to knowledge and scholarship. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best.